Good morning, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to Miami, Florida. We got the keys here to the Super Trofeo Amalagato. Now you're probably confused. I bought a Huracan Strato, and that's right, I did. That car is in New Jersey getting full paint protection film. We're in Miami, and we have the STO. We're here in Miami for one single reason, and one single reason only. I'm on the hunt for the hypercar, and there's a dark horse candidate, a Lamborghini. The 918 Spider is out. The Chiron is out. The LaFerrari is out. We've narrowed it down to the Koenigsegg Regera, the McLaren P1, and the Lamborghini, the Centenario. There's only one issue driving a super trofeo race car, a homologated race car, and that is the storage is very, very, very weak. We got to use this key to open up the Kofengo. Kofengo. Ko, ko, I don't know how you pronounce it. Kofengo? I think that's what it is. So right here on the left side of the bonnet, you can see a little keyhole right there. There's I, one that's broken. Oh, that, no, it's meant to be broken. It is. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's a, that's that a blank. That does not look like it's meant no, to it be is, broken. No, it is. It is. Look, because it doesn't go in that little key slot right there. It's perfect. It's a Kofengo. Twist. Now this is definitely like one of the coolest features of the Huracan STL. The only problem is driving a homologated race car, the Super Trofeo Amalgato, Super Trofeo being the Lamborghini race team, homologato being the Amalgato. You only have room for a little trickle charger right there, but uh, somehow we got we got to get all this there. Yeah, right? That's not happening. Yes, it is. We can do this. We can be very persuasive. Sorry, no. Okay. This is going to be absolutely no big deal. I'm assuming by now you probably realize this is not my Huracan STO. So the owner of this car has an exhaust coming very, very soon. It definitely needs one, but he also owns a Centenario. I am so embarrassed to even admit this. We have room behind in the back. Kind of. Little persuasion, little optimism. <laughs> Easy. Oh my gosh. <laughs> okay. I like this car. I like the soundtrack too. The last month has been so crazy. We've been just crisscrossing across the United States of America. We had the P1 of the Chiron in Ohio with Triple F. We had the 19 with the Hamilton Collection in Utah. We had the Regera. We had the Law for our Destroyer in Tennessee. The Regera was in California. Miami, we got the Centenario. I'm trying to figure this out. It's been crazy. Miami Centenario. So a buddy of mine, he owns the Centenario. He called me the other day. He's like, dude, you got to get some seat time in the Centenario. We flew here immediately and we're driving the Centenario today. Sophia is yelling at me right now because I don't know how to say Huracan. How do you say it? Huracan. Huracan. Speaking of, there's a Huracan right there. There are Lamb Lamborghinis everywhere here in Miami. How do you say Urus? Urus? Urus. Urus. Not Urus. Urus. <laughs> and out of, out, no, 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 no. That's a brand new Lotus. See you, dude. The spec on this S2 is absolutely beautiful. I love the orange Alcantara. Now, unfortunately, my Storado, Verde Scandal wasn't an option on the Alcantara on the steering wheel, so we went for the all black, which is totally fine. We have 784 miles on the odometer. We got the carbon fiber door panels. So we're headed off to Lamborghini of Miami, Prestige Imports, but on that bombshell, today's video has been sponsored by ShipStation. I first started Stradmerch almost six years ago, and in the beginning, I was actually doing everything myself and things are fine and then the growth happened and things are not fine anymore I was stressed out of my mind. I was mislabeling packages I was sending the wrong package to the wrong person you guys were mad and I was bleeding cash and then an epiphany I switched to ShipStation and it changed everything ShipStation saves me time It saves me money, but it also allows me to focus on other avenues of my business guys If you're looking to start a business if you're looking to grow a business switch to ShipStation 130,000 companies have worked with ShipStation to grow their business and 98% of companies guys that work with ShipStation for one year year are customers for life. And my favorite part about ShipStation is how easy you can automate shipping tasks. Maybe you have an Amazon, an Etsy, an eBay, maybe you're a Shopify seller. Well, with ShipStation, you can actually consolidate all your orders from all your different platforms into one simple dashboard that you can manage anytime, anywhere. Now, maybe you're shipping out five packages a month or maybe upwards of 50,000. Well, ShipStation scales when you do and their enterprise solutions will actually help reduce your warehouse costs and increase your profitability. And with ShipStation, you get access to industry-leading discounted shipping rates with UPS, USPS, Global Post and DHL, up to 89% off USPS and UPS. And it really is just that easy. Let your customers shop risk-free this holiday with ShipStation. Go to ShipStation.com slash Stradman today and sign up for a free 60-day trial. at ShipStation.com slash Stradman. There's just nothing quite like Prestige Imports Lamborghini of Miami. I remember DuPont Register as a little kid seeing the cars here at this dealership. There is no place quite like it in the entire world. They also have the brand new Lotus Electra, 905 horsepower, and the reason I know that, we were researching it on Wikipedia. We got the facts. That's right, we got the facts and figures you love. I may be wrong about this fact, but I believe that Lamborghini Miami is the largest Lamborghini dealership in the entire world. They got everything here right now. They got a Storado right there, and look at the color on that Urus. That is Verde Scandal. Viper Green right there. It is December. I know, it's 75. It's, too nice. it's not fair. What is going on? Look at the color. Well, inside Lamborghini Miami is a very, very, very special car that I actually filmed about six six or seven years ago. Now inside the dealership, it's a professional environment, and so we're gonna be very mature. Hi. Sophia sometimes in Lamborghini dealerships just gets out of control, shouts what at the camera, so about? we're gonna be we're gonna be very quiet. Right? Yes. Right, yes. yeah, okay, that goes to you. <laughs> This is one of the 
the scariest maneuvers right here because this car is worth $3 million, this car is worth $3 million, and the last thing you want is to back the two cars into each other. The back of this car, the diffuser, this is quite possibly the greatest diffuser of any car in the entire world. We have a very nice Dorado right there. The Tentenario, Tentenario. Now obviously precision is of the utmost importance right now, but the boys here at Prestige are the best of the best. This car is so wide, these doors are so narrow. This blue Cebus under the sun though, this color is absolutely gorgeous. Now I want to reiterate, this Centenario is not currently for sale. This is not the one that I've been hyping. That one is actually a Roadster in St. Louis. This is a coupe, one of 20 coupes for the entire world. And this is our ride effectively for the day here in Miami. Now we're not going to drive this car that much. This car is worth north of $3 million. It has around like 800 miles on it. Absolutely love this car. The few off Lamborghini, the Centenario. It's not Centenario, it's Centenario. Out of absolutely nowhere, what is this guy doing? We got the roof box, bro. What's up? Are you on the phone? He's on the phone. I'm sorry. I'm so sorry. He's on the phone. I told you we were going to embarrass ourselves, but look at that car. You need the ski box. I need the I ski box. Really I do. There's just something about a Centenario that gets me going, boys. So you guys know I'm a Lambo fanboy through and through. I love the P1. I love the Koenigsegg brand, but there's just something about the Raging Bull. I told you guys, if you like Blue Cephas, today is your day. Now, the million dollar question, Ivan, is it yes. Centenario or Centenario? Centenario. Centenario. Oh, what is it? Centenario. What? I keep saying Centenario. It's Centenario? Oh, I was right. told. I was told by an Italian it was Centenario. Yeah, Italian probably right. I am so sorry, sorry bro. bro. I didn't know you were on the Stop phone. It. I'm so, I'm sorry. Family. Don't even worry. Uh, the Don't man, the myth, the legend. Brett Davis. From Miami, baby. Thank you. Thank you. Go oh, crazy, right? A Storado, the box? How'd you get that box? Is I that a factory upset. option? It is not. I played with a few boxes. And okay. I, know I just happen to like the shortness of that box. I love the shortness. Yes, exactly. Perfect use for what I exactly. use. Exactly. I have to tell you something. Lamborghini knocked it out of the. God box. bless Lamborghini, right? Bro. What brand is building an off-road supercar that you can put a ski box and a bike rack on? Yeah. Lamborghini. Stefan Winkleman. I love you, sir. Genius. Yes. I have to tell you something. If I could have asked the car gods for the perfect car, right? That would be it. Yes, baby. Come on, Dude, baby. Thank you so much. I appreciate oh, it, Mr. Brett David. Big hugs, brother. Blue Cephas SVJ Roadster. The Miami color game. It's second to none. It's always so special to be in a Trenton as Paul said, on cold tires here in Miami. There's only 886 miles on this car. This thing is absolutely pristine. Also, one thing I want to note, the exhaust on the Centenario, it is not the same as Interventor. So if you try to tell me it is, it's not. I don't know what Lamborghini did to this thing, but it sounds absolutely deadly. Miami really is the Lamborghini capital of the world. Everywhere you look, everywhere you turn, there is Lamborghinis everywhere. As far as just a one-two punch, it is hard to beat these two cars. Centenario and STO. So if you've never looked better, look at that smile. What? If timing is right, the Centenario doesn't play that, that it is. <laughs> Sometimes this Centenario is just popping like absolute crazy. The thunderous boom clap of a V12 in a V12 Lamborghini Aventador. It's a dying breed. God save the V12s. The back end of the Centenario. Oh, this car is so, so good. Look at this car in traffic, though. Wow. It looks so crazy. Oh my goodness. What did you say with the Centenario? It is Chef's Kiss. <laughs> it's a Lamborghini. That car, one of 20 for the entire world. Bro. It's so good. <laughs> You gotta see this car in traffic. The one of 20, the Centenario. That car is an alien spaceship. <laughs> the heat coming off that thing. I mean, look at the back of that car. Sitting here in traffic. Back to the STO for getting in trouble. It's always slightly nerve wracking getting the opportunity to drive a car that is this special. Owning a car like this would be such a surreal experience because there's only 20 of them in the entire world. We are not going to drive this car very far or very hard, but uh, this is Centenario. Just a little bit. Oh, she's fucking hard right now. Oh my goodness, this car is so crazy. This guy right here is rocking the Ferrari hat, getting shots of the Centenario. That's the Lambo effect right there. Now I drove this exact Centenario, I wanna say in 2017, 2018 maybe. The car had less than 100 miles on it. We now have 899 miles. These guys know what's up. Should I get a Centenario? One thing I love about the Centenario, it has the all wheel steer. So the practicality of this car 
is unbeatable. Oh my gosh! <laughs> okay, that is enough. That is enough. You guys know my favorite car in the world is the Lamborghini Aventador. This has the same six and a half liter and the transmission, God bless the single clutch. That's it. We're, we're not doing that ever again. Well, I mean, unless I own one. Unless I own one. Everybody wants him to rev the chest in the area. You gotta love it right now. Oh, getting the photo, look at that. You see that? That is the Lamborghini effect right there. There's nothing quite like it. Out of the Tesla as well. All right, what's up? A couple baby revs maybe in the Centenario? Maybe, maybe. There it is. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. <laughs> it is definitely the crowd pleaser, that's for sure. Centenario, P1, or Koenigsegg? Uh, Koenigsegg. Oh, okay. Always the egg, I love it. Have a good one, dude. There you have it, ladies and gentlemen. Centenario in the flesh, he's still choosing the Koenigsegg. Sophia, I'm putting you on the spot. Oh, never mind. Yeah. You got out of it, you're lucky. Uh, <laughs> I think that's really, really cool. Centenario, yeah. okay. She's a Lambo girl. It sounds so crazy. Oh my gosh. A Lamborghini, the Bortigini, the Bertigini, the Alfredo. It is just echoing off the skyscrapers right now. Look at that thing. <laughs> That is a stock exhaust. Lamborghini didn't do anything to that. That is completely stock. It is so good. Yep, yep, yep. That is stock, baby. <laughs> Anybody who does not love the Chantanara says, oh, blah, blah, blah. It's just an Aventador. Listen to that thing. That's an NMP12. What? Aventador is probably my favorite car in the entire world. So the fact to have one with a limited edition bodywork, one of 20, will be an absolute dream come true. That thing, the road presence too, it is unbeatable. I feel like every single Lamborghini here in Miami is just over the top, brightly colored. Look at you, what in the world is that? That color's sick. It's so sick. My voice is very high pitched. I apologize. She's right here. She's, in, she's right here. Hey, hey, hey. <laughs> Canadian citizen. Kind of sort of here, someone illegally. We got to get this girl what are you across the border. No. I'm here legally, guys. Don't listen to him. We got to get her across the border very quickly. 296, baby. Get a V12. Perfumante Spider. I mean, as far as. Oh, no, 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 bro. Bro, you did me dirty. Welcome back to Lamborghini of Miami. What a crazy day here at Lamborghini of Miami. So, Sophia, you like the Centenario. I like and it. And I like you. And that means, do I go Centenario? I think it's a great option. I think you like Lamborghini. I love Lamborghini. It makes sense. It's got a six and a half liter V12. There's one for sale in St. Louis, Missouri, right around 2.7 million. It's got 78,000 miles. So I can drive the car as well. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Do we go Centenario? It's fun to say. It's way more fun to say than the other cars. Let me know in the comments below. Massive shout out here to Lamborghini of Miami. More to come. We're just gonna do another loop just so you can see all the crazy colors. And I did confirm actually that yours is Verde Scandal. It that is? color, it's Verde Scandal, yes. What? Isn't that crazy? It has like a greenish hue to it. Beautiful. Well, that right there is a parking spot for a Huracan STL. Look at that. Single car parking. That, Sophia, is why we always stay at the Holiday Inn Express. Not a paid product placement, but if it could be, that would actually be very, very beneficial. Find yourself a girl that lets you film every single aspect of your life. I embarrass her constantly, but it's I. And she wears a backpack. Well, I think that's pretty much gonna wrap up today's video. So tomorrow, we're actually flying back to New Jersey. We're picking up the Huracan Strato. We are headed north to Toronto, and then across to British Columbia to Victoria. But on that bombshell, today's video is over.